Tonight, an emotional show of support for a longtime Boy Scout leader who was killed by an alleged drunk driver. Dressed in uniform, scouts came together tonight for a man who, as the Boy Scout honor code demands, helped other people at all times. Ken McLeod has the story tonight from Tewksbury. I'll take one, thank you. What was planned as a Troop 49 candlelight vigil instead became a community hug fest, as Tewksbury remembered a former scoutmaster and some soggy camping trips. But Dave made that trip fun, memorable, and worth it. He's talking about 58-year-old Dave Penny, who headed Troop 49 for a long time and who many still regard as Scoutmaster Emeritus. He really put his heart and soul on the Scouts. But the next event many of these folks attend will be Penny's funeral. On Saturday afternoon, Penny was riding his beloved Harley in Northampton, New Hampshire, when state police say a BMW plowed into him at an intersection. 38-year-old Jennifer McCoy of Boston has been charged with drunk driving. She wasn't hurt, and neither was her teenage passenger. I, I, it came out of nowhere. And what's been lost, say those who knew him, is a valuable community resource. Somebody who went above and beyond to do what he could to make sure they had an amazing scout experience. And that's something that'll stick with these young scouts for a long time. <laughs> he bailed me out on more than a few occasions. Uh, from just bad decisions. But it wasn't just the kids. Penny also challenged fellow adults to pitch in on a number of community projects. He really lived by uh, the code cheerful service. And now those he served say they'll do their best to look after Penny's wife and teen son, who is still a scout in Troop 49. He would do the same for us. In Tewksbury, Ken McLeod, WBZ News.